Welcome back to Babes in the Woods, an original comedic mystery adventure on Paris Underground Radio. What could possibly be more enchanting than the dulcet sounds of a piano? And what's more inviting than a piano bar? Joanne and Britt have finally had their prayers answered. Just kidding, this is only episode 9. Who knows just what or who they'll find inside this alluring establishment? Should they venture upstairs? And just who are you calling a harlot? And now, episode 9, The Piano. I've never been so happy to hear piano music in my life. Where there's music, there must be a musician. Come on. Wait, hang on. What? Why? Well, what if it's the preacher? It's not the preacher. How do you know? I don't know. I have no idea. But chances are that it's not. It's not church music anyway. Let's at least go and take a look. Maybe they know the way out of here. Maybe they have food. Oh, God, I hope they have food. I'm starving. I hope it's a restaurant. I hope it's happy hour. Oh, my God, I could kill for a martini. I'd kill for a pina colada. And a steak. And five steaks. Who am I kidding? I'd kill for a slice of bread at this point. Oh my god, I think it actually is a restaurant. A restaurant or a bar? They're probably open, right? I mean, if the musician's playing? I think so. This is where the smoke was coming from. There must be a fireplace or something inside. Maybe the second story's a hotel. Oh my god, a real bed! One thing at a time. Do you have any money with you? No, but I'd gladly give them a leg for a home-cooked meal. Sam. All right, should we go in? You first. Hello? There's no one here? Hello? Who was playing the piano? I think it's a player piano. What does that mean? You know, those old pianos where there's like a roll inside and you wind it up and it plays by itself. Okay, but who wound it up? Ah! What? Look behind you. What? You see that mirror behind the bar? I thought I saw people moving. Oh. Jesus. Is that what I look like? We've definitely looked better. I look like Grizzly the Mountain Woman. It suits you. Bite your tongue. Oh, my poor dress. Hey, look back here. What is it? All the bottles are broken. It looks like someone smashed them all on the ground. Who would do that? Why? You thirsty? To be honest, I can really go for some hundred-year-old moonshine right now. Well, someone must have started that piano. We should check and see if there's anyone here. And food. We should check for food. Food and a hundred-year-old moonshine. Got it. Look, there's a fireplace. It's still lit. There has to be someone here. Maybe they're upstairs? Hello? I guess it's worth a shot. How's your ankle? Much better since I soaked it. Think you can make it upstairs? I bet I can even make it without the crutch. Huzzah! You're so weird. It's just a long hallway. Hello? Well, let's check the rooms. Maybe they're sleeping? That's the t- 
tiniest bedroom I've ever seen. Yeah, it's basically just a bed. One star. Do not recommend. Come on. Huh, another tiny bedroom. It doesn't even look comfortable. I don't think this is a hotel. These rooms are too small. I think this is a... What do you call those places where nuns live? A convent? Yeah, maybe this was a convent. Yeah, I don't think this was a convent. I'm pretty sure those beds were used for something other than worshipping Jesus. A whorehouse? Shh, keep your voice down. Yeah, I think this was a brothel. Cool. How is there no one here? Hey, Joanne? Yeah? Come here for a second. What is it? Can you take a look at this drawing? Holy shit. Does it... It looks just like you. How is... That's crazy. She looks exactly like you. Like if someone drew you in one of those old-time photo studios with those Western costumes. Maybe I was a madam in my past life. Should I keep it? I look better in this drawing than I do in real life. I can make it my profile pic. Might belong to the person who lives here. Hang on. Okay, done. So, I guess we go downstairs and wait for whoever lit the fire to come back? Sounds good to me. We'll be right back with Babes in the Woods after a word from our sponsors. And now, back to Babes in the Woods. Wherefore, O harlot, hear the word of the Lord! Jesus Christ! You scared the shit out of me. Shh! He's holding a torch. Let's try not to piss him off. Thou hast played the whore also with the Assyrians, because thou wast unsatiable. Yea, thou hast played the harlot with them, and yet couldst not be satisfied. Um, is everything okay? Sorry, we didn't mean to intrude. We were just looking for whoever lives here. Shall not that land be greatly polluted? But thou hast played the harlot with many lovers. Yet return again to me, saith the Lord. Is this about the collection plate? Britt, give him back the collection plate. Here, it's all yours. We're really sorry. And they shall burn thine houses with fire and execute judgments upon thee in the sight of many women. And I will cause thee to cease from playing the harlot, and thou shalt give no hire any more. Ah! He threw the torch at us! Let's get the hell out of here! Come on, I saw a door back this way. Dun, dun, dun. Stay tuned for episode 10, Confessions. Thank you for listening to Babes in the Woods. Babes in the Woods is written by Barbara M. Bedis and Jennifer Fox Garrity. Part of Joanne is played by Sion Dason. The part of Britt is played by Jennifer Fox Garrity. And introducing Darren Lay as The Preacher. Our theme music is Despite the Traffic by Wes Hutchinson. Babes in the Woods is edited by Jennifer Fox Garrity and produced by Paris Underground Radio. If you like our show, please subscribe, rate, review, and tell your friends. It really helps. For more on this show and shows like it, please go to parisundergroundradio.com. Thank you for listening. <laughs>